Oh, God. Oh, uh, okay. No. No Palutena whatsoever. Instead, it's going to be the Roy. Roy. All right. I like this because Palu does struggle with Pokemon Trader. Uh, Pokemon Traders will be inclined to agree for a certain point where it's like Palu cannot handle the early game against Squirtle. Squirtle just makes Palus want to throw their controllers. But the other two characters, it's over. And that's the thing. But I've seen Quid, and Quid has a very really impressive Squirtle. But let's see if he can get oh, off yeah. the ledge. Jen keeping the pressure. Oh, Ooh. nice job. I will say, though, that I do feel like, especially at those lower percents, that Roy can also struggle against Squirtle, but against Ivysaur. The fact that, despite Roy being a sword character, he normally doesn't like to be at the uh, the sword character range. He likes to be in your face to get those hilt hitboxes. And that's when Ivysaur, we're seeing Quid, has been able to, for the most part, wall him out with back airs, with razor leaps. And, oh, Nice, Dare F tilt. All right, let's see. He's off the level. Ooh, and you, they'll nerf that move three times in a row. Doesn't change the fact that hitbox is gigantic. Roy, oh, they just take taking a moment, looking at each other, having a great time. Nice Charizard. And let's see. Charizard Roy is not as bad as people would like. Oh, I thought that was a grab. Maybe he buffered A, but he's taking this guaranteed stage-to-stage -stage damage and sweet spotting all of his tail. <laughs> oh, my guy was, like, feeling himself. He's like, all right, all right, all right, let's bring it back. Let's bring it back. Yeah, but... That overextension, Jen, getting right in there for that perfect punish means that he's going to avoid taking even more Squirtle. damage, especially against a Charizard, considering the fact that Charizard, as he has rage on him, Ooh. is just absolutely a monster to face down. Instead, it's a low percent Squirtle, but not fun either, but... Good, th good thing he kept his jump there. Quid looking like he almost just got knocked in. Oh, you love to see the tech chasing. Oh. Squirtle's aerials all feel way bigger than they should be. Oh, he got on the stage. I wasn't expected either. Rolled away to try and cover ledge options, but he wasn't even on the ledge. All right, let's see. We're still... Man, his air dodging, not to ledge, has worked out for him every time. Ooh, he tried to get the reverse vine whip. That will end your life most of the time if you're not paying attention. Ooh. All right, now you're in the air, and you don't own just forward smash him. All right, we take those. Quid will, and so will I. We will take those. And that was because of the slight hurtbox shifting as Charizard reels back for that forward smash. Very great awareness on Quid to use that micro spacing to his advantage. <laughs> and now that puts him with a hefty stock lead. Only about 104% on this Ivysaur. And the Ooh. Ivysaur... Mm, chair back air, not going to work. Let's see. Oh, don't fall for it. All right, re-grab. Roy not really punishing a re-grab option, so I respect the attempts. At best, you have neutral B to go under and maybe down tilt to poke. Now we're back to the good character. Let's yeah, see. I do think it's worth that even though he re grabs, he didn't necessarily punish. Instead, he punished the buffered option with that neutral air. So that was still great stuff from Jen, keeping this game even. But he is now an offstage Roy against the Squirtle. And we've seen already Quid Squirtle puts on so much Ooh, pressure. Jab lock into F smash. That hit. If Squirtle smash attacks start up any frame sooner, they would be like top five. They kill deceptively early. Down smash will kill you at 100 at ledge. Forward down smash just killed at 90. Down smash's end lag is, is non-existent. A, non it is a baiting tool. Yeah. I see Squirtles just throw out down smash. People are like, oh, you threw out a random smash attack. Get punished. And Squirtles like, no. I call that wolf syndrome. <laughs> uh, when you get wolf up smash, you're like, yeah, I got them. Spot dodge. Man, they really be like that, huh? Same with down smash and F smash. All right, I respect. See, like, I feel like no matter which character you picked, town and city's the wave. All right, they asked me a question, but here we go. Yeah, town and city is definitely the wave. Uh, yeah, no, kills off the side. The fact that this has, because of the way that the platform extends, you know, it's a long main platform, that means that the side blast zones are very, very close, and Roy is a character that loves to kill off the side like that. Of course, Pokemon Trainer has access to those sorts of things as well with Ivysaur Uppy or a nifty little Squirtle combo, which is kind of what we're seeing at the moment. He's not really letting him land. Oh, I thought that was down smash, but it was forward smash. Oh, not getting the jab lock this time. Good awareness. Oh, no. You always hate when you don't turn around at the right moment. So far. And let's see here. Oh, no. No two framing down tilt on this one. Good swap on the spot dodge. Oh, let's see. You do not want to be here. It was a good swap, but it happened to put him on in the corner as Ivysaur. And Ivysaur, despite the fact he has really great neutral and quids Ivysaur in particular, probably his strongest of the three Pokemon, uh, is not a character that likes to be Ooh, running out there. Let's see. Nothing. All right, your turn. Let's see what happens here. 
Oh, no, that was it. That was the time, and he caught the roll away into F tilt. That's yeah. going to take that. And that's that running turnaround F tilt in order to get that extra push to make sure he had the sweet spot. Jen finally with the lead here. Let's see if he's able to do that much with it. Wind looking to get in with the Squirtle. Okay, I like that. He was going Squirtle because oh, he wanted to get on the stage. Oh, the platform. No. <laughs> you hate to see it. I mean, if you are Jen, you love to see an easy way to get back to stage. And oh, with that, he's now at 150 and tons of rage and dead. Seismic Toss coming in, taking him at 150. Let's see what we could do next. And then, oh, the thing when you're playing Roy in this matchup, it's like you see these Dow tilts. I agree, but Squirtle's not staying on the ground most of the time. We're using that broken fair. Ooh, and you see the side be taking advantage. You don't want to land. Pokemon Trainer, if they have one weakness, they cannot land. This character struggles. If it's not swapping into it, they didn't give this character a good way to land on any of the Pokemon, which is why Palus will decimate the other two Pokemon, but Squirtle is just small enough to get away. You can really see why Jen is sticking with the Roy. Ooh, Ooh. that upbeat doesn't get the sweet spot, so not that far off stage. He has no jump, though. What a down smash, and just for style, unnecessary, but just sends a message. It might have been necessary just because of the fact that Magnet hands and Roy does have good drift. He has really good air speed, so don't even mess with it. Double tap him, make sure he's down there in the blast zone. Ooh, the shield pressure said, ah, ah, forward smash. Just let him have it. I think we saw the very beginnings of the of the grab animation from Ivysaur. If we so. were thinking about it, but that's technically still a tether grab, so it comes out, I believe, at like 14. It's yeah. not that good. Let's it is see. Not, it's not a great out of shield option, and the fact that Jen knew that he was going to pick a slow option like that is why that forward smash was perfect oh. in that situation. First time I've ever seen Tomahawk into Squirtle grab. I mean, jab, but I got grabbed. All right, let's see. Ledge against Ivysaur is not fun or for either of them. Let's see. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I love it. He ran through him. He had the idea, just not the execution. Oh, um, this is not... You can't get down. This is where that town and city... The time you're not playing on FD, you're miserable. Oh Back air up B is taking it at, like, 83? I believe you're supposed to DI down from that move, but it's, it can be so hard, especially when you're nervous. You're rolling. You're